commonly asked question is what should I fly, nitro or electric? Uh, that's actually a good question and it's pretty much entirely personal preference. Um, here we actually have two different helicopters. Uh, they're, they're the same helicopter but one's electric and one's nitro so I'll point out a few different pros and cons. Um, obviously the obvious one is the nitro is dirty. Um, so if you're a clean freak or if you like to keep your helicopters inside the house or on carpet or something, electric might just be a better choice. On a serious note, the difference between nitro and electric are the, the pros for the electric are it's, it might have a little bit more power for a given weight and size of a helicopter. Um, it'll be a smoother, it'll be quieter, and the maintenance is overall quite a bit less. Um, the pros about the nitro motor are it runs off of nitro, so you only have to buy as much fuel as you want to fly. There's no initial battery cost investment. Uh, the other thing is it's quick to refuel. There's no charging time. And also your flight times generally, depending on setup, uh, same with power, um, with generally with setup, your nitro, sorry. And usually with the nitro, you get a little bit longer flight time depending on setup. Um, the biggest changes that you're going to notice is the electric might be a little bit heavier overall. Um, you have a speed control down here, a motor, and then a battery. Um, where the nitro, you tend to just have the motor and the pipe. Uh, once again, depending on setup, the weights could change, but generally the electrics are a little bit heavier. If you're looking at like a 90 class model and a 50 class model, nitro will be a little bit cheaper alternative because there will be less initial cost. Um, in the long run, though, the nitro will become more as you start to burn more fuel um, and start to have to maintain the engine. The electric, the initial cost is a little bit more, but as long as you take care and break in your batteries well, then they should last quite a while. Anything smaller, like in the 30 size range, uh, the 450, the 500, um, generally it's best to just go with electric because for that specific class, the power to weight has been developed enough that actually you get more power for a lighter weight in that class. Yeah.